Hey there, welcome to Studio 62. I'm Jamarcus Gashin, and today we're joined by a very special co-host. I'm joined by Big Brother 16, Jocasta Odom. Yes. Thank you so much for being here. Everyone's like, is that that girl from that TV show? Yes. You are. You are just, um, this is nothing like the Big Brother house, though. No, no. It's better. <laughs> it, it's, it's better. We don't have any <laughs> secret cameras anywhere. There won't be any clashing of tables or of anything like that. Of course not, and I can talk to people. Yeah, you don't, you don't have to do any backstabbing or anything like oh, that. Oh, no, I don't. Yeah, so That's we're so better. excited to have you here in the upstate. You're just from Georgia. Georgia girl that drove up here for a very special moment that we're going to talk about a little later in the show. But just to give people a little bit of, a, of the basis, um, you were just on the show. Yes. What did you learn from that experience? We're going to talk a little later more in depth about it, but what did you learn from the experience of Big Brother? So from the experience of Big Brother, I learned how to be patient. <laughs> uh, it gave me great patience. I thought that I learned patience being on bed rest with my boys, but being in that house, Help me to be patient, help me to love my loved ones more and mm -hmm. be able to show them that I absolutely love them because you miss them for a hundred, over a hundred days <laughs> and you don't know like, oh my gosh, hey, they love you just as much. And mm -hmm. when you come out, it's a newfound love. So I have greater love for my loved ones. So I bet, I bet. That was awesome. Well, we're so glad to have you as our co-host today. I don't have yeah. a co-host, so I was like, Jocasta's gonna be in town. We'll have her drop by and be here with us. So we'll talk a little bit later about why, uh, why she's in town. Thank yes. you so much. Be sure to join the live chat happening on our Facebook page. Just search Studio 62 TV and click like. Uh, we're gonna be giving away a couple of prizes later in today's show, so we'll have uh, the keyword for you win there. We start this morning with a good news story from Clemson University. You can feel the energy as Clemson's men's soccer team clenches the ACC championship. We're joined in studio this morning by players Bobby Belair, um, Ara Amira Khanan, I think that's how you say it, and assistant coach Liam Karan. Thank you so much for being here, guys. Thanks for having us. You guys all have the Clemson scarves on. That's very, very nice there. Con congratulations on your, your recent you. win. You. Uh, how do you feel after that? I mean, you could feel the energy by looking at that video. It was a happy moment. Yeah, uh, it was absolutely incredible. And just to share with everybody, all the teammates running in the corner, it was just, just blessed to have the opportunity to do that. Going on, going on the field, what, what goes through your head when you're taking on something like that? Obviously, you guys, um, the season probably up and down, and so that moment, very special. Yeah, yeah I mean, we, we really have just been sticking together all year long. Um, we have full confidence in ourselves, in ourselves and we believe that we can, we, we can stay to the end with any team, and uh, we've proved that in the ACC Finals. As a coaching perspective, when you're watching watching that, uh, what was going through your head? Was your heart beating a, a little harder during that <laughs> that situation? Yeah, it was. Uh, we left it a little bit late, uh, but at the end of the day, we we kept believing, and that's kind of been the uh, focus throughout the season is uh, believe. So we, we're going to continue to do that uh, as we head into the NCAA tournament, uh, and we hope that we can uh, get a good crowd at Riggsfield uh, come Sunday against Coastal Carolina uh, for the next step in. Uh, the journey. Yeah, you guys just figured out or just found out that you're playing Coastal. How are you feeling about that matchup? Confident. Uh, you know, we, we played them earlier in the year, uh, beat them 2-1 uh, in overtime. Uh, but look, like any tournament game, it's going to be a tough match. So we're expecting their best and uh, we're going to give them a great game. So hopefully we can uh, get some good support out to come out and uh, join us. Jacosta, I, I think you're like mesmerized by the I, accent. I am. <laughs> I'm like Liam, in, in shock here. I'm like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> hello, I'm Jacosta. Hey, I'm Liam. Yeah. <laughs> What are you all to expect going into this? What do you expect? What are you gonna, how are you preparing for this? Good question, how? Jocasta. I mean, don't get too comfortable in this co-hosting role. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> no, that's a, that's a great question. Um, basically, to what we're expecting, we're expecting to win it all. We're entering this tournament for a reason because we believe we're good enough to be here with a seventh seed. We've proven we can beat anybody in the country and we're in this tournament to win it all. First title, ACC title since 2001, so it's a, it's a, it's a big moment. Uh, any pre-game rituals that you guys do that uh, we, we should know about that, you, that are TV friendly? We may not. I was going to say, I believe the we could <laughs> um, we, we like to listen to a certain song before as a team, and we all kind of jump around together, uh, and we get a little hype in the locker room, but 
Um, other than that, there's nothing too crazy. We uh, we keep it basic. I was wondering if the if the scarves possessed any magical powers, like you don't you haven't taken it off since. <laughs> We've got two for the We've never Oh, look yes. at that! Oh, we'll, see, we'll see what kind of suit. Oh, I want to I want to put mine on right now because I feel like it gives us okay. gives us a little extra Thank extra you. swag. If we want to buy tickets to a game, uh, go to the website and, and check it out there. Or? Yep, um, you'll be able to get them ClemsonTigers.com um, and. I want to say they're $8 uh, for, for adults, uh, but you can get them at the game also. Scarves sold separately. So so, yeah, yeah, but they'll be thrown <laughs> in the crowd. So right, you, if, there if you like catch one, see. you get it for free. Right, <laughs> exactly, exactly. Uh, Mr. Mr. Clemson, you can't, you don't really talk or anything, so <laughs> if you had to sum up the excitement of the moment of winning this championship and going into the NCAA tournament, what would you do it in a dance move? If you had to do it in do a dance move. To, okay, oh. all right, all right, all right. <laughs> That's a whole lot for Gaston's good news there. So we'll, we'll, we'll hold you off there. Thank you guys so much for being here with us this morning. Best of luck to you. Definitely go support them. Again, if you want to buy tickets, you can go to ClemsonTigers.com. Uh, and we're also going to put some photo, uh, photos of their win on our website, too, so you can t okay. check that out. Thank you, gentlemen, for being thank here. You. Thank you very much. Come back and see us once you win it all. We can't wait to have you back then. Thank you. All right, thank, thank you. you.